My whole life, I've always wanted to look big. Growing up, as many of you may know, I was a very skinny lad. And while many people dreamt of having six-pack abs with their perfect beach body, my ultimate goal in the gym was to look big in clothes. A year and a half ago, I think my beach body looked alright. I had abs and some decent muscle. But in clothes, I just looked super skinny. Fast forward the clock to now, and while I don't look big in clothes yet, I definitely look a lot bigger. So how did I do this? Well, obviously apart from cramming food down my face, I also started working on this part of my body. You see, this area is what can make someone look big. This is what can make someone look masculine. And whether you're sitting, standing, wearing clothes, it's always on display. So for the past year, I've worked on this area, and this is what I did. So in order to build this bigger upper part here, there's three muscle groups you need to train. Shoulders, traps, and neck. First, let's start with the shoulders. Now, I made a full in-depth video on how I personally built my shoulders, and that'll be linked down below. But to sum that up, you wanna be hitting all three heads of the shoulders. Shoulder press and front raises for the front delt, pullbacks for the rear delt, and lateral raises for the side delt, which the side delt is the one you wanna hammer the most. Doing this is gonna build that big, round, broad look when you're wearing a t-shirt or a vest. Next up, the traps. Now, like many people, I used to neglect these and just not train them whatsoever. That was until I realized how much bigger it made you look in clothes. Now, traps were a very simple muscle group to train. I do two heavier sets of 10 to 15 reps on barbell shrugs. I make sure every session to progressively overload if that be more reps or more weight. Then I move on to two sets of just complete failure with dumbbells. It doesn't really matter the weight. I just want to be burning them out at the end. Again, I do this twice a week and it has grown my traps significantly. Finally, we moved on to the neck. Now I'd say that less than 1% of all gym goers even train their neck. And considering it's always on display and it makes you look really big, I don't see why that's the case. Look at Mike Tyson for example back in the day. His neck was extremely wide due to him training it a lot for boxing and in clothes the guy looked like a monster. And once again like the traps, it's a very simple muscle group to train. I bought one of these neck harnesses off Amazon for literally 20 quid. Twice a week before bed, I do two sets to failure of neck front raises, two sets to failure of neck back raises, that's it. Look, I don't know if this is the most optimal way of training your neck, but it's worked for me. I've had many compliments on it, and importantly, it doesn't affect the rest of my training in the slightest. So give these a go, incorporate it into your training, and it will definitely help make you look that little bit bigger, that little bit more masculine.